Hi, I'm Mariston. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm planning for the week of February 5th through the 11th. And yes, I'm a little bit late posting this video, but I had already filmed it and edited it and I had not completed the voiceover, which is why it is so late. But I really like how it turned out and I want to share it. I mean, most of it's already done, so why not share it? And there are other videos that I happen to film and edit in back in January and I still haven't posted. So I'm just going to go ahead and post those. So this month will be a little bit more heavy on videos. I hope you guys don't mind and just like the content that's being put out. Now... This one um, was actually a pretty fast plan with me. I usually take about, I don't know, an hour and a half, an hour and 40 minutes which eat, with each spread. This one in particular took a little over 30 minutes. And just speeding it up, well, it's going to be about 12 minutes. Also, cutting out the boring parts where I'm like thinking, moving around, so yeah. It shortened out to 12 minutes. And this week I decided to use the Oh How Lovely um, sticker book. This came in last year's Valentine, I believe, Be Happy box. And I used it last year, um, not enough. And so I wanted to use it this year. I know it's not the typical Valentine spread, but I still like how it turned out. And it's very... I find it to be very festive. The other thing is that I use all those big stickers um, that remind me, I don't know, like a Game Boy or yeah, like a Game Boy. And um, they take up most of the page. So I really didn't decorate a whole lot. At least I don't believe. Um, but in the end, I think it still turns out really cute. So here I am, I'm placing the washi and I'm doing a vertical kind of stripes with my washi and I'm layering this. The colors are a little kind of different, but this color palette in this book is different as well. And so I just thought that this washi would complement the stickers of this book. So like I said, I'm using these big uh, stickers and I use them, um, I don't really like, I just need boxes to write out my stuff and it doesn't matter how I place the boxes because I can always put a line through there and divide it by day so I wasn't worried about that. Um, I haven't done lines for quite a while in my planner honestly I can't even remember when was the last time I did lines um, so they're not really I'm not missing them I guess that's kind of where I'm at so at least this week I don't know about next I don't know about this upcoming week um, maybe oh no not even because this upcoming week I used the miss maker layout that has the checklist in the middle so i already have lines so i don't even need to add them so that's even better so yeah so i haven't been missing the lines in my planner lately um we'll see how long that lasts but right now as you can see i placed my washi and those two big stickers and now i'm focusing on my sidebar and i did add a box there because since I'm using those big boxes in the uh, on my actual days, I thought it would be nice to have a box if I needed for, I don't know, priorities or whatnot. And if I don't, you know, use that for that, then I always use it for my gratitude list or my happy list or, um, I don't know, something uh, positive that happened during this week. So I've been focusing 
at least in February, I've been focusing on kind of self-care and kind of those positive wins during the day. And it's nothing like the over, not this overly positive uh, type of feeling, but more of kind of cheering myself up with anything that I find to be a win. Like, for example, I... Let me see. This past week, I've taken um, the time to read. So I've taken out an hour to read every day. And that's something that I find to be a win. And so it, I'm, I've i been... Um, I can use that box for that. Um I've also like created my monthly and that's something that I'm going to be posting this week as well, which you'll see, get to see what I'm talking about um, because I focus my monthly on the wins, like one win a day and kind of like memory planning on my monthly. So I'm really liking it and I like how that spread turned out. So yeah. Um, yeah, you'll get to see that this week and what I'm talking about with kind of my wins. So here I am, I'm putting kind of those, I really like those floras and I was kind of upset that the happy planner didn't include like a whole page of those florals, like the different, um, sizes, like small and big. Uh, but I used what I had to kind of fill up the top and that page is pretty much done like I said, with those big stickers, I really didn't need or had to do much. So now on the other side, I'm going to do the same thing with the washi. Now I was trying to kind of figuring out how I wanted the washi to look, but didn't realize that I did kind of exactly the same way that I did on the other page. And maybe I should have I don't know, instead of doing two boxes, one box, and, and kind of alternated it, but I didn't think about it at the time, and when I was editing, editing it, I realized what I did, and I was like, ah, I should have thought this a little better, but I don't know. I was in the zone when I was creating this spread, which is why I think it was a lot faster than usual, and... um I don't know, sometimes it's like that. Sometimes I'm in the zone and I can like crank out spreads very easily versus other times that I'm just second guessing myself or like, I don't know, starting to uh, question what I'm doing. Uh, here with this spread, I was just very decisive and like, this is what I'm doing. This is where I'm going to put the sticker and moving on. Um, and I kind of like that and I wish I was like that all the time, but nope, that's not the case. So we kind of roll with what we can roll that week. Um, my monthly is another one that I kind of cranked out pretty quickly, even though I was very indecisive in the beginning. Um, once I sat down and started planning it, it just went by very fast. So yeah, so you'll get to see that as well um, this week. Um, it's a very short video. Well, I say short, but I mean, it's between 12 and 13 minutes. And I kind of like that. It's kind of short. <laughs> so here I am. I was fixing that sticker because it was kind of a little uh, crooked. And I was having a hard time. I wanted that kind of like periwinkle because I wanted to bring that more of that color to the other side, but I didn't know where I was going to put it. Um, I ended up putting it under that box, which I thought would be the decorative box, which I thought would be where it made the most sense. So now I'm just adding some more hearts around the page, just finishing up those little details to kind of give it that Valentine's kind of feel. And then I move on to adding some more of those 
pretty little flowers on the top of the page around the dates and the days of the week. So I will finish up with that. Other than that, I don't add anything else to my pages. So I think it turns out to be really cute. Very simple, even though it looks very stickery. I mean, it's just those really big stickers, box stickers in the middle of the page. And other than that, I mean... <laughs> I, there's nothing else to add. Uh, I think it turned out really cute. And yeah, I'm, I'm writing in it is going to be fun. So I will punch the holes on it and put them on my disc so you can see how that looks on the discs. And yeah, that that's pretty much it um if you have recently subscribed to my channel i wanted to say thank you so much for subscribing and i hope you like the content if you um do please let me know if there's anything else you'd like to see also let me know and um, if you're returning, thank you so much for continuing to support my channel. Um, remember that if you want to see more of my content, you can definitely head on over to Instagram at my little planning corner because I usually add a lot more content over there than what I do on YouTube. So yeah. Thank you so much for being here. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing, like, comment below. And yeah, this is the end of my video. Here you can see, I'm putting away a couple of things, but here you can see my final spread and um, this is pretty much it. So thank you so much for watching. I will see you on the next one. Bye.